Hey guys, welcome back to Factorial. This is Eddie Man, episode number 90. Yes, it's episode number 90. And we finally, finally have a red circuit fix. Finally. I know I've been, I've been saying it since last episode. Uh, we're going to go ahead and tackle that issue today. And hopefully we should never have to worry about not having red circuits again. Uh, we have a new condensed version of the green circuits. I, I like this this way better with the stockpile of the green circuits. Um, yes, it's only two stacks. And why am I wasting steel, steel for the steel chests? I, it's just my just my liking, my base. So, mm. <laughs> anyway, um, this should suffice our need for um, circuits, green circuits now. Um, I know the iron is a little short here and the copper is a little short. Uh, so, I don't know if these can handle the 16 uh, line of 16 here. Um, so, do going back up to the chip factory. Um, I, we might just have to just condense it down to eight here and make, uh, two, uh, well, I'll figure it out. Maybe, maybe I'll just work on it off, off camera or something, but, um, yeah, let's go ahead and, well, we're going to need these. So let's take these. Oh, oh, not the whole thing. Oh boy. All right. Um, we'll need those. We need those. We'll take all the circuits. I could put those back for now. I don't need those right now either. These I don't need right now. Okay. That gives me some wiggle room on my inventory. Okay. All right. So this here, the red circuit fix. Um, so the build I have, the blueprint I have here, doesn't have modules in them, and I don't think we will need them. Okay, yeah, I don't think we're gonna need modules for this. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So we want to double this up. Okay. Get this mirror. I think we should just mirror it. Yep, okay. We're just gonna go ahead and mirror it. It's a little tight, but I think we might be able to sneak it through. Okay. Once we uh, that we have that gap in the middle though, it's gotta go down, back to the base, back to the bus here. All right. Um. How much is this down here? That's fourteen with three. Let's use this. Okay. I know what we're gonna do. I see it. I uh, see it, I see it, I see it. Alright, so we have copper is here in the middle. That is bad. Okay. Yeah, I know, I said I was going to tear this all down between episodes. I got anxious and <laughs> I just started the episode. So, 
And these are assembly three machines. Wow. Well, we might as well use them since we have them. The question is, does it need its own stock? And I'm going to say no. I don't think it needs its own stock of green circuits. Green circuits are here. So each line needs a full belt of green circuits. I'm not doubling this up without doubling up the input. So I need to double up the input. Yeah, I'm talking to myself. <laughs> it's okay. Um, all right, so I'm worried about this gap here. I don't know if we have enough space between the two arrays. See, we have the green circuits coming from here. What if we have this to supply the rest of the base? And we bypass... This bypasses the red circuits altogether. And then we just keep these two lines. Because I need two lines anyway. Right? So I build one here below and I build one above and then all I need to do is bring up plastics and copper plates up here I don't know I think I can see it better if I tear it all down all right, let me go ahead and jump off camera and I'm going to tear all the the red the old red circuit array down. Okay. I'll be right back. Hey guys, I'm back. All right, so I've come up with some kind of plan here for the stockpile and to bring back to the bus. All right, so just bear with me here. We have um Two long-handed inserters that will feed into um, buffer chests here. All right. Um, I guess I could do. There's two, right? Now that I'm. Now that I'm looking at it, we can do that. Okay, and then this would go like so, back to there. All right. And we have... I need more steel. That's not a problem. <clears throat> And the power poles, right? Because we don't want to forget about the power. We need power to run it. And it looks like a mess. But it might just do. Oh, they need to bring the potential copper up here. to you all right and then the potential copper is just going to be um, two. there okay and then that's going to be um, you and you However, you want to connect that. 
is fine by me. I think we'll just run power here. Right. That is not needed. Uh, let's see what this looks like without. I need this. So I don't know what power is going to be situated there. So right now we'll just bridge it with that. And we can fix that in a little bit if needed. Okay. See, I'm not sure if it needs to be all red belt. How's that? And then we have this plastic coming up and then it's going to feed this is going to science Oh, just move it up by one. Okay. Move this whole thing up by one. You'll see why in a second. Alright. Oh, I didn't even have to. I could have just done it. This way here, like so. So no, let's not move it up by one. Let's keep it where it was. Like that. Okay. Because um, the plastic's going to come up and be on the inside, and then this will be on the outside, but then it, then it needs to be on the inside, the opposite way. So. so that would bring plastic and copper cables up to where we need it. Perfect. Okay. And then we'll worry about it once it gets past this stage here. Can we just live with this? We probably can. Boy, out of those yellow inserters again. Might be able to get away with just that. This is a mess. But once everything is full, it'll look. Yeah, it'll be okay. I know it will be. This is our PS around array here, cutting through here. Let's just strain this out like it's supposed to be. Okay. <clears throat> Perfect. Okay, this, this gone, this gone, all that gone, this gone. All right. So that's for the uh, copper cables. Okay, and then everything else will be this 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 14. So 14 on each end.
So if we bring them both up. We are getting rid of this line here, right? So this middle line doesn't need to be here anymore. bring this down oh we can't all right let's leave it like that then um i need a line of 14 and a line of two four six eight 14 is not gonna fit That's 14, okay. And then let's see how big this is. Oh. What if we move that down? We have some space. And then we brought this up. might just fit then I need a buffer oh that buffer is down here so I don't need a buffer I just need to get both feeding both lines feeding to one belt and then this would be the this would be my buffer here. Okay. I need to create another blueprint of this here. Okay. And then I want to tear this down. better than the whole thing after the whole thing was done <laughs> if you follow me on that one your bots I don't have any bots <laughs> okay that's the length that's that perfect we are gonna smack this 
right here. And okay, it lines up with that and that. That's fine. Still nice. Okay. And for now, I don't know where the underground is going to end up. So let's just. Keep it like that. All right. Well, these guys I never put in. It's all right. sure if they need to be fast let's make them yellow and if they do need to be fast we can upgrade them at a later time power I think I got it all. Down to you, 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 you. This to that, this to that. And then in one. What am I going to bottleneck that for? Okay, and then the six blue ones in the middle here. The two. Perfect. Oh, the two on the side here, that and that. And then the two lights. All right, so now I'm if I want to get the uh, 14 in here, I need to do a little dance. Okay, we need to start it there and end it there. Get rid of these two. All right. Do I run it up and then back? Oh. Do I really want to do that? It's not even need needed anymore. What is this going to look like? Oh, we're going to come. Okay, um, let's just do that. We could bring it down. Uh, 
Okay. The green circuits are going to be here. So we could bring it down. you and then bring it back up right here Then we will have our way this way, and that buys us all the space we want going forward. Okay. Perfect. Okay. It's crazy how much cup coil we have, but that's fine. Down. All right, so starting here, all up we still got plenty of room on us person so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen Uh, I don't think we need anything beyond that. Okay. I will fix it. So then these are going to be red circuits. Right. Might be a waste just making it. Yeah, part of me just wants to make them these. Right, we'll just make them them. Okay. So now we have our two lines and a line going down. So we're just gonna copy this then. Okay. Skip two. Two, skip two, skip two, skip two, I messed up someplace, skip two, two, 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 skip two. All right, guys. Sorry about that little um, mishap there. Um, I was counting and I didn't realize the recording stopped. Um, all we did was hook up some resources to the line here. And I went ahead and changed these to level two assembler machines. Um, the level three ones give you the ability to add uh, modules to them, more than two. Um, so, but I think this should be suffice. Let's bring this up. It's red to you. Okay. And then we need to get rid of this. And then this is just following what 
I need here. These reds. Okay. And then these will go like this. I think that should be all I really need, believe it or not. Okay. And then lights over here, I'm sure we can figure out something. That should be suffice. And then all this I'll tear down the rest of it at a later time. Because I think this should be all we really need. And then again, we're just going to mimic the opposite side. Oops. Uh, let me grab a copy from... Oops. grab a copy from you and paste them in here. Perfect. Okay. And then these we could just take all these out. And right now I'm just copying the other side. Make sure I don't miss any. Okay. And the same thing with this. I gotta get better at placing the inserters. Because that's what the speed it's all about. And then we have that. Power poles there. doesn't need to flow into there anymore. You can have this stop. So we need this and then we need that. But then we need green circuits for here then. Okay, I see what I could do here. Let's just cut this. And then this, we run the opposite way. 
this way. And then this can go all the way down to there. Yep. It's going to take a while for this to fill up. Okay, lights, lights. We all get lights. And I think we can match that. And then we can match this up here with that. I guess the same thing with you. Alright. I wonder if I double this. We can expand this up. To here. Just to get some more red circuits flowing. I'm not sure if this is faster. It's a better design. I, I just like the... It just seems better. I guess it's just the same concept, but... Condenser, less belts. Okay, well, we'll see what it, that does for the base. Yeah, the base is lacking in red circuits, big time. But unfortunately, that's all the time I have for this episode. I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up here. Um, I think I'm satisfied with this build. It's uh, less condensed, and it looks um, like we are on a roll here. For bigger and better things. Um, yeah. Now this. The green circuits here. Are. Flowing. Better I see. Alright. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me. In this episode of Factorio. Um, if you haven't yet, please go ahead and consider throwing me a like for this video. It greatly helps me out and the channel out as well. And if you want to stay up with everything Anyman, um, you always have that option of smacking that big red subscribe button to stay up with everything Anyman. But again, thank you for joining me in this episode. And like always, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.